if you see the amount this industry's changed in the last five or six years, it's been huge. So before we start beating ourselves up, I'm going to come on and beating ourselves up straight away. But before we do, I think we should recognize the amount of change. Uh, I, you know, I've been in, in business and in marketing you know, for 30 years. And the, the, the 25 years before the last five years, there was less change than there has been in the last five years. And that's hard to respond to. I can think that you know, I went to do one of those um, Silicon Valley tours six years ago. And at that stage, you know, Twitter didn't even get a meeting. Twitter was someone we met uh, for a drink at the bar before dinner because they were an interesting company. That was sort of, you know, six and a half years ago. Uh, and, and look at the, you know, a massive business it is now. So with that amount of change, I think it's hardly surprising uh, that um, even for a mass market consumer goods business like ours, uh, that you're having to learn as we go. And we've seen some great examples of that. I mean, one of the greatest examples I've seen is actually Facebook changing from, from being uh, a PC business to a mobile business without you know, losing a beat. You know, it's like changing the engine of a Boeing 707 while it was flying. Uh, and they did that. Uh, and so it can be done. So I think for our industry, I think we need to just own up uh, to the point that we need to get uh, a really fabulously well-built industry so we can all compete like crazy um, in, a, in sort of clear uh, waters rather than bumping into each other because we're not quite sure uh, what's going on. So one thing I've, I've talked about a lot last year, and you'll have seen uh, me sort of campaigning around the world on it, was viewability. So how do we, in the digital world, get to a situation where people are actually saying that seeing half the pixels of, of a video for two seconds could count as a view. I mean, if you just stop and think about that, and if you just you know, give it your, um, your brother, sister, or friend test, and go and get outside the industry and just say, do you think that should count as a view? Anyone would say, absolutely not. So I think as an industry, we just need to own up to like, what is the sensible metrics. And, and what we've been saying is you know, complete viewability uh, is, is the only, only sort of standard that we should be going by. Uh, and we need to find ways of doing that in the digital world as much as we do uh, elsewhere. And then from viewability uh, to verification, third party verification. You know, we can't have a situation where billions of dollars are, are moving around um, and we have third party verification in some parts of the industry but not in others. So I think we just need to be you know, clear about that. This is not about distrust, this is about just good business. You can't have uh, you know, people grading their own homework. We need to all understand that you know, we need to be judged for what we're doing in a positive and professional way. And then the last part of, the, of that is value and to make sure that then as media dollars move around, we can understand what the value is and we can make um, choices in, a, in a, again, a, a clean and professional way. And these are the, the three Vs of, of viewability, verification and value. And if we get those right, I think the industry will grow and grow and grow. I think uh, I'm a great believer. Uh, we've, uh, last year, we put an extra 250 million euros into advertising. We have increased our advertising year in, year out since 2009. And the wonderful uh, you know, bullet that uh, hit us all uh, with the recession and, and everyone started saying this is at the end of advertising and there's going to be huge pressure and advertising has come down. Well, let me tell you, Unilever's put their advertising up, up, up. We really believe in advertising. And advertising is a great way to connect with people and to nourish uh, and build our brands. But we have to do it uh, in an industry that has a responsible approach to how it views itself and how it sort of makes competition work really well. 